Hey guys, what's up? I'm back again, myself Sandeep Roy and I'm gonna teach you today sketching of signals, how the signals are sketched. So let's just jump right into it. Our first question is x of t, where x of t it means just by its name we can uh, say that it is a continuous signal that is x of t. If it is x of n then we can say that it is a discrete signal but it is a continuous signal. So now how to sketch this so we know that first we have to draw two coordinates this is the this is for amplitude this is for time t now this is x of t signal and this is zero this is the origin of the signal now as per the question it is given that when t is 0 t is less uh, greater than equal to 0 to less than equal to 4 that means t varies from 0 to 4 the amplitude is 2 that means we have from 0 to 4 that means if you consider this point as 1 this point is 2 this point is 3 this point is 4 this point is 5 until 0 to t x of t exist that means amplitude is 2 for example this is 1 this is 2 this is 3 where 2 is the amplitude we can say that from 0 to from 0 to 4 amplitude is 2 that means it also says that at 1 amplitude is 2 at 2 amplitude is 2 at 3 amplitude is 2 at 4 amplitude is 2 so but at 5 what is the amplitude so it is said that otherwise it is 0 that means at 5 it is 0 okay now what should we do that we have to see whether in between the amplitude varies or not that is the most important thing because now in this problem it seems like it's so uh, easy that only from 0 to 4 it varies as 2 the amplitude is 2 but in some questions you might get confused because there are some problems where in between the values changes so I uh, will see that later but now we'll just focus on this question so here from 0 to 4 the amplitude varies that means we just have to simply join this dot till 4 so at 5 it says that it the amplitude is 0 we no need to draw so now you check in between 4 and 5 what should be the value 4.1 that is like it should be less than or equal to 4 if it becomes 4.1 then it is 0 for here it is 0 amplitude 0 amplitude 0 amplitude 0 amplitude 0 till 5 or for till infinity now what we have to do just we have to join this to 4 that means it comes till 4 then after a single uh, increase increment it will continue to be 0 and same case applies for 0 also amplitude exists only till 0 only till 4 and this is our signal this is the signal x of t what we want now we'll go for the second question where x of t is given by 3 2 0 I hope it will be easy for you as you understood this question this question just a little bigger version of this question so now this is the amplitude where x of t is the signal and this is the time axis now it is it says that the time axis have mm, the, uh, the time axis varies from 0 to 2 2 to 5 that means we need to draw 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 okay and amplitude is 0 to 3 okay for example we we'll just take the we we'll just take till 4 now how to draw this it says that from 0 to 2 from 0 to 2 amplitude is 3 that means amplitude we can directly join it from this point to this point 
no need to check in between values as because from 0 to 2 amplitude is 3 fully now we just say from 2 to 5 from 2 to 5 it has given the amplitude as 2 so now what should we do from 2 to 5 amplitude is 2 this is the point of 2 this is the point of 5 we have to join this now this is the main part like you see here that the at the point 2 two amplitudes are there 3 and 2 so just do you have to do one thing that is to join the upper amplitude with the lower amplitude that's all like we did for this thing from zero, from amplitude 2 to amplitude 0 we just have joined this vertically and this also vertically we have to join and this also vertically we have to join to 0 that means from 0 to 2 amplitude is 3 0 to 2 from 2 to 5 amplitude is 2 2 to 5 amplitude is 2 that means it says that from 0 to 2 amplitude 3 also exists and in 2 2 is also um, exist so and till 5 it goes now we'll go for the so this is our signal x of t now the third question it's little tricky that the signal x of t have value it will uh, it has an amplitude of t which varies from 0 to 3 and 0 otherwise how to draw this let us draw the axis this is the time axis this is x of t signal of amplitude 0 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 Four. according to the question it says that uh, uh, x of t signal exists only from time 0 to 3 so from 0 to 3 the time exists and the amplitude is t so how to sketch this for sketching this we just have to do one thing that substitute the value of t in the in every place of the axis that is here t is equal to because this is the time axis here t is equal to 0 so that means the amplitude will also be equal to 0 because here t is 0 so at t is equal to 1 amplitude will be 1 because amplitude is t and t at this point is 1 t at this point is 2 at this point is 3 but the signal exists till 3 otherwise 0 that means as we have learned earlier that if it is 0 otherwise then the last point just have to join vertically down with the 0 thing so join this now this dot what it represents this represents the amplitude of the signal but why uh, you might have some question that this amplitude is uh, straight this lines are horizontal but this line if we draw this then it will be inclined because the amplitude is not constant here we have the amplitude constant it is 3 or it is 2 but here the amplitude is t which means it varies according to the time when the time is 0 amplitude is 0 when the time is 1 the amplitude is 1 when the time is 2 amplitude is 2 when the time is 3 amplitude is 3 so in between 0 and 1 each and every value the amplitude will be like this because it keeps on increasing it all it will also keep on increasing. just just try to visualize this thing in this way like if you increase from 1 to 2 here also it will increase from 1 to 2 from 1 to 2 it will increase in this this manner because it will come like this right uh, I hope you understood this so now only one task is left that is we have to join this join the dots and that's all our signal is ready so this is the x of t signal
we got our signal now we'll go for our next question fourth one now it's a similar question with uh, this kind it says that where here x of t varies from 0 to 3 like the signal x of t exists from 0 to 3 and the amplitude is t plus 2 0 1 2 3 4 5 1 2 3 4 yeah now we just have to see how the signal is getting varied so now what is happening here it it is saying that the signal is varying from 0 to 3 and the amplitude is t by 2 from 0 to 3 amplitude is t plus 2 that means we have to say we have to do the same thing as we have done it here we have to vary the amplitude that means if t is shown at the amplitude that means the signal is not a horizontal line sorry for the inconvenience battery is slow actually <laughs> okay so here mm, what I have is, yeah here uh, if the amplitude where t is mentioned it means that the uh, signal will not be in horizontal line signal will be inclined here because t is mentioned t means uh, the time at that means the amplitude will vary with respect to time so now how to plot this we got t plus 2 so at 0 what is the value of t at t is equal to 0 this is 0 so 0 plus 2 it is 2 so the amplitude is 2 now at 1 what will be the um, uh, amplitude substitute 1 in place of t 1 plus 2 will be 3 amplitude is 3 at 2 2 plus 2 is equal to 4 amplitude is 4 at 3 3 plus 2 equal to 5 Amplitude is 5 at t is equal to 3 amplitude is 5 just now we have to do one thing that is sorry, amplitude is 5 we have to do one thing that we have done for the every problem that is to join the signal join the dots as easy as this so this is our signal where uh, the signal x of t varies from 0 to 3 0 to 3 and the amplitude is t, t plus 2 t plus 2 so at 0 it will be 2 at 1 it will be 3 at 2 it will be 4 at 3 it will be 5 and join the dots so best of luck We'll meet in our next video about reflection of signals, how to draw the signals which are reflecting. So, thank you. Bye-bye.